Øh, det er sgu... Du kan godt snakke om hjertet. Jo. Det er sgu... Okay, så kigger den igen. Don't tell me more. I don't know if you're looking at my camera. I think my camera's gone. No. Still there. Ah, right. We're back. Um, the one that I've got here comes in a tin, so um, it's also got a white seal on the back. So you just score it with a knife or whatever you can get over to score it to um, uh, open it. It's also got the green AMD sticker on the side as well. Um, I have taken out the, the heat sinker and that to save time. Um, you do uh, get the, the manual, just the manual book and also the warranty book um, to uh, tell you how to put it in and how to put it in correctly. You get this plastic uh, cover uh, with a little sticker on this beside it. Uh, the processor is well very light. It, it's, there's no weight in it at all. Uh, yeah, that is where obviously, and then obviously the underneath is all the little pins. And I will point out that you need to be very careful that you do not uh, pick this up by the pins when you're taking it out the plastic cover because you will damage it and then that's a waste of uh, whatever how much money you've spent on it uh, the price for this one would be roughly around the hundred and roughly around the hundred pound um, uh, mark in British money and uh, I wouldn't know what that is in um, American money or whatever. In the box here, what you can see, you've got your heat sinker, which is very chunky. It also comes with thermal paste, so you don't have to put any more on it. Which you you remove this plastic cover, and you've got uh, a copper plate on there with the two pipes coming out either side and that will uh, draw the heat out. They do uh, say in the manual of the processor that you, do, you use the heat sinker and the, the fan that has come with the processor um, because obviously the, the place that I bought it from is it's still under guarantee and it's still under a three year warranty. Uh, the processor goes in this little square here you lift this lever up, which is at the side. Oh, I'm going to tangled up there. Before, I would also point out, before you even start putting that in, the processor in, you do have to wear an, uh, an aesthetic wrist strap or anything ecstatic to take the uh, static out of your body. When you take it out, you lift it by the edges and you make sure that you don't drop it or in face down where the pins are because of, they can also get damaged that way as, as well you will notice that uh, if you can see it quite clearly hold on there is a gold triangle on the corner of the processor and you match that with the arrow on the processor square plate on the motherboard. It also gives you a description of um, of the processor as well and where it is made and this one is made in Malaysia and also defense in Germany. It's a 2012 11 chip. Now, this chip is slightly smaller than uh, the uh, other chips that AMD has got out. Unfortunately, I haven't got uh, an AMD one to, uh, free to um, an AMD plus three chip to 
tell you or we can show you the difference and uh, but these ones are slightly smaller it has got eight chips in it uh, because obviously it's an eight core processor and um, when you put it in you make sure oh I'm going to turn it off there. These straps are quite fitted. When you put it in, match it up with the little triangle on the board. Um, oh, I want it in the wrong way. Uh, nearly. Uh, just uh, drop it in. Well, you don't drop it in. You just uh, slide it in, or you just put it into place. Um, I will point out you don't have to use any pressure um, to put the processor in. Don't force it in, or don't push it in with your hand, or because then you will uh, break the heat. When you put the, uh, the heat sinker on, you take the plastic cover off. Uh, get in that box as well because I don't need it. Always best in one to keep the packaging just in case you need to send it back or if it gets damaged. Uh, you will notice that uh, you've got a little black lever here. Um, it doesn't matter which way uh, you put this, but it's always because obviously the cable's quite long, so it can. Well, uh, no, you don't want it the cable going over. The, the fan so it's best to always well my opinion would be always put the, the cable closer to where uh, the uh, cable has uh, got to be plugged into these are, can be very tricky because they've got two black pins uh, either side to hook the Heat sink are on. You are doing oh, I'm just checking. Uh, you make sure that you get it dead right in the centre. Uh, that fits nicely in there. I'd also point, I would like to point out that you do get some idiots that think, oh well, because uh, it, but that all you can get some people that think, oh, I haven't got uh, thermal paste on or uh, heat sinking paste on. You know, I just don't want to go in there. Yeah. Uh, that uh, they wipe the thermal paste off uh, because they think that it's not enough and they put like, Probably a <laughs> uh, thick layer on, and then they come unstuck, and they land up blowing the processor and weaving the motherboard. Uh, just bear with me, guys. I'm just trying to. Ah, 